right, we are back, and we restarted the modem to re reconnect errors. Uh, hopefully, this could try one other option. If it is still choppy, the only other thing that I haven't done yet that I still could try is to switch it over to my phone service and not my router here at the house. So let me know how it's coming through, if I need to switch it out or not. Uh, still getting that reconnect issue. Uh, still got some awesome stackers, some Masses of the Universe, Predator, and Alien. Uh, Virgin Variants, Incredible Hulk, Venom, Batman, Aor Man, and Iron Fist. I'm still getting this reconnect error. It, I think I'm, uh, like oh, I said. She's back again. Yes, still bad lag. Wow, really? Even after all that? Okay, um, data. And see if that makes any difference. All right, so uh, we reconnect it using my, my phone as a hotspot now. So pulling the data from my phone now, hopefully uh, it's not choppy anymore. Hopefully it's a little bit better. I'm praying, fingers crossed that it's running better now, guys. Uh, give just a second. Um, anyways, like I said, got some really cool stuff up here. We've got some Thor slabs. Uh, feed is real bad. Uh, give it just a minute or two. I just switched off the, uh, the Wi-Fi and put it onto the um, phone itself. So give it just a minute or two uh, and let me know what's going on. Katie said seems to be a better stream. So let's hope that's what it was, guys. Let's fingers crossed that's what it was. All right, so we have the Thor slabs up here. Uh, we have some Golden Age stuff up here. Uh, we have some, you can hear full sentences, seems better now. Awesome. Okay, so share it out. Yeah, sh share this back out, guys. Now that we've um, switched to our channel, we're also a lot clearer now. Please, please, please share this fresh one back out. We definitely appreciate that. Uh, we have these Golden Age Tales to Astonish, Journey into Mystery up here, the Liberties comic signed, some other beautiful Thor slabs up here. Um, we have a few stackers of... Uh, Masters of the Universe, Mixed Spider-Man, Predator and Alien, Daredevil, some beautiful books up here on the rack, all types of different goodies, ASM, Kazar, Iron Man, Journey into Mystery, uh, Nick Fury, Thor, all the goodness, we got some Power Man, Conan, uh, Thor, uh, God of Thunder, Thanos, Transformers, Captain Marvel, and Avengers stackers, all types of goodies, and we still got this big old fat pack of eight slabs here. Uh, we had somebody asking about those earlier. Uh, if you're still in here, uh, I can't remember the guy's name. It was Samuel. Samuel. Samuel, if you're still in here, uh, we still have these available, man. It's 1130 to buy all eight of these. Or if you want to get all eight together, we'll do it for a thousand flat and knock off 130 on the eight slabs. Let me know on that. Uh, still got these two stackers here. Well, not stackers, but stacks of really nice higher grade x-men there's a couple there's like two or three mid grades in there but most of these are high grade a lot of first appearances a couple of the euro variants really nice ones man first hellfire nice frankie reprint beautiful high grade 108 75 uh 107 122 nice clean copy just a really nice stack of x-men right there man really really nice ones um how much for the transformers uh, the Transformers stack is 75 for 11 issues, and that includes number 4, number 10, number 11, number 12, 18, number 21, I forgot I have one other one too, buddy, uh, you were asking about these earlier, 24, 25, 27, 28, 29, yeah, it ends at 29. So, very nice run on those. Um, the X-Men stack, they're individually priced, Jason. Um, if you wanted to get all of them, I could give you a price. But uh, a lot of those are a pricier books, man. I'm not going to lie. That, that stack will be pretty pricey. But if you wanted all of them, let me know. Um, if, the, if that's the stack you were talking about, those nice Bronze Age uh, X-Men I was showing. Um... Any secret wars? Yeah, Andrew. Hey, Andrew. Uh, I got something I think you'll like, dude. Hold on. Hold on. I have a book. This is cool. I like I like when I have something that I feel like, and I hope he does like it too. I, I, I'm not like, I think you'll like this. He's like, it's trash. No, I think you'll like this. Um, I have something for you and mine specifically, bro, that I think you'll really dig. Granted, I can find it. Here's another cool Transformers I'm going to pull aside in case you're interested. 
that uh border issue um where is it oh 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 oh, oh, oh. there it is donny cates Signed by Donnie Cates. It's the Secret Wars Thanos 1, or excuse me, Thanos 13 Lenticular. 50 bucks on that. Signed by Donnie Cates. Very cool if it zooms in. There we go. Very cool, man. I would send that one off to CBCS, bro. Send it off to CBCS. People ask, like, well, why don't you send it off to CBCS? Well, to be honest with you, because of this. Because I have too much going on. I have way too much going on right now. Um, but it would be worth it to send something like this in, man. Very cool book. Donny Kate's signature. 50 bucks on that one. Um, I do have some other Secret Wars stuff, I think, but not much. I think I might have a number five. A nice clean number five. Let me see. Joe, what's going on, man? Thank you for the share. Appreciate that. Appreciate all the share, uh, the shares out there. Uh, Jason, give me one second, and I'll hit you with the prices on those X-Men. I just want to check out this other Secret Wars real quick while it's on my mind. Actually, I think it's back here. Yeah, it is. Secret Wars, 25 bucks. Number five, high grade. Um, trash. I was just kidding. Sweet. Yeah, add it to my box. Okay. Nice. That is a cool one, man. I thought you'd like that. The Secret Wars, awesome signature, too. It's a funny story about this one. I did not catch the signature when I first got this book. I pulled this book aside to originally keep because I liked the lenticular. Later on, I discovered the signature on this one, but awesome book, bro. So 50 bucks on that one. That's a Donny Kate signed Secret Wars. Um, with that Donny Kate Secret Wars, come back slab with a yellow strip at the top. Uh, if you go through CBCS, I think they do give a yellow now. They used to do a red, but I think CBCS has switched over. Um, but yeah, that's an awesome book, yeah. man. Yeah, they, Didn't they? They did switch, they right? Same, yeah. yeah. Uh, so we got some Astonishing Tales, some Master of Kung Fu's. Is any fans of those? Some nice early defenders. Like I said, guys, if you see something you're interested in, let me know. Annual Defenders number one's in there. Because I got some Captain Marvels in here. Some nice ones. Mm, excuse me. A bunch of Marvel 2 and ones All types of stuff in here, man. Um, CBC, excuse uh, me. I'll take the five as well. So the number five as well for Andrew. He wants that Marvel Secret Wars five. If I can find it. Where is it? That one's about to, well, not about to. That one is getting hot right now, the uh, the Secret Wars stuff. Because it's going to happen. We know the movie's going to happen, right? We've got, you've got um, Doom coming. They, they're talking about Esposito being Doom. I think that'd be fantastic. Uh, let's see. Christopher Tans, uh, X-Men? Somebody say X-Men. X-Men, sorry. Uh, X-Men 107. Um, okay, so these are the Furies. We're going to move them out the way. Um, no one said anything about that Transformer, so we'll move that. So the 107 is 45. 45 on the 107. So Jason has been asking about the stack, the whole stack. Oh, the whole stack. Um, <laughs> of X-Men? Uh, okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, all right, well, all right. Um, let's go through it. So you're looking at 45 and 75, man, mathing, um, that's what, 120, and then 55, so 175 plus 45 is 225, yeah, 220, uh, plus 55, so 275, um, plus 60, so that's what, three, 335, <clears throat> Plus 65, so you're at 395, plus, 400. huh? 400. 400, 400, yeah, I'm math and terrible. <laughs> plus 60, 460, and then 120, so 580, plus 45, 625, plus 40, 665, and then 55. So that's what? 720. 720 is what all these are priced out. These are a lot of key issues, a lot of higher grades too. Don't be confused by the bag either. These are nice copies. The bag might make them look funny, but these are nice copies. Uh, most of them are in Mylars. There's like one or two mid grades. This one right here, because it has this little speckling deal going on. Um, and there's a couple ticks on it. And this one here is a little, 
little bit of a lower grade, well, mid-grade. Both of these are mid-grades, but the other ones are all really clean. The 117, the 114, 122, 119. Two Euro variants in there as well, the 12 pences. Uh, the 131, the 132, first Hellfire Club, second Dazzler, first Emma Frost cover, Frankenstein, first appearance reprint, high-grade 108, the 75, the 107. Um, yeah, so... Uh, so Samuel's back. Uh, how much was no Iron Man 252 right now? I got rid of that recently. Uh, conditional 107. Uh, I'm not sure the exact grade, man. I'll show it to you. It's not a, a low grade, but it's definitely not. It's a, it's a mid grade. Say it's a mid grade copy. Um, I'm not going to put a grade on it. Like I said, I don't do the number grading thing, but I've called it a mid grade copy, but very oh, nice. Um, <laughs> yeah, he definitely wants to lose stuff. Kong, what's going on, buddy? Uh, Samuel, the X-Men stack was 720, 720 on the X-Men stack uh, for everything in here. But I would do a discount if somebody wants the whole thing. Uh, the whole thing would be 720 I would knock 70 off and go 650 if somebody wants the whole stack. 650 takes the whole stack. Um, well, you got good feeds. You might want to talk about this. This again. Yeah, let me, <laughs> let me show some of these too. Yeah, Sam, now that you're back and now that the feed's back again, let me show you them slabs <laughs> as well. Because there's so much good stuff I have out here right now. So we got these monstrous high grade X Men run. And then we have these right here. You were asking about these slabs earlier, Sam. Uh, on the eight of these, bro, they're priced out at 1130 between the eight. But if you want to get the eight of them together, we'll do it for a thousand flat and knock off 130 bucks. Monster discount, man. $130 off. It's basically like giving you more than one of these slabs for free because there's a couple up here that don't even, aren't even $130. Um, but obviously there's a couple over. But yeah, it's basically like giving you one of the sla over one of the slabs for free. So 1000 takes all eight of them if you want to do that. Uh, what would you say the biggest key out of the X-Men stack? Man, there's a bunch of them to be honest with you. Uh I, I, it's hard to say which one the biggest is. And this isn't even all the X-Men either. This is just the older stuff that's out right now. But I have even more uh, other key issues and stuff I'm going to pull out here in just a second. Just waiting to see what, what everybody wants to do as far as the X-Men up here and the other ones. And no doubt, Todd, I got you on that $30 offer. If he doesn't grab the stack, I'm going to give priority to him and two, it was two people. It was so Jason Samuel Ray and... and Jason Ray. Yeah, Samuel and Jason. And then Samuel asked about it after Jason. Yeah, yep. And now Todd wants the one, so. Yep. So. So we're waiting to see what everybody says, see what they're interested in. So first of all, Jason Ray. Is he still out there? Beautiful X-Men, man. Really nice, clean lot. Damn, it's a nice lot. Uh, the 107, I think, is 45, and the... 108 is Jason in the past. that's a beautiful one. I think that's 55 on that one. 55, I think, on the, the 108. It's a beautiful high grade, crazy nice copy. Shiny staples, super clean spine, sharp corners, beautiful, beautiful book. Um, Jason, we're going to pass on that stack. Thanks for going through it. No problem, Jason. No problem at all, brother. Um, and 131, 131 is the, oh yeah, that's the uh, second Dazzler, first Emma Frost cover, beautiful book, man, awesome, awesome, classic copy, classic issue, this whole, this whole era, man, these, these early 100 X-Men uh, from the like 100 flat beyond, there's a, there's a couple pre-100s in here too, you got the 88, 75, um, and a couple low 100s, 107, 108, 112, but yeah, some really good ones in there, man. A lot of X-Men in there. Still got a stack of Nick Furies, too. Beautiful stack of some Furies. Early, early issues. So we're waiting on Samuel on the X-Men stack. Yep. So priority is on Sam on the X-Men. Let us know. Fury 19, Fury 15. So that stack starts at Fury number 15. I also got that Transformers Water book. Uh, X-Men price stack. Uh, oh, it was valued at, what, $720 originally? Yeah. We had it valued at $720 for all of them, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 
Uh, mostly higher grade issues. But yeah, I was about to say, there we go. Okay, so Sam has the X Men. I'm about to say, I, I knew I knew talking about it that somebody was gonna grab him. Like, there's too many nice high grade ones up here for somebody to not grab that. That was a hell of a deal right there, man. Nice, nice stack of books, bro. Like I said, these are all out of my PC too, man. And I'm not lying when I say that. Like, I can't begin to tell you guys, like, this is my PC, and I've been selling this stuff off to get my building, so. That's what I'm doing right now, man. Seriously. Um, yes, Sam, you got the X-Men, brother. You got the X-Men. Um, you got the stack for $650, bro. Uh, then... Where was I? Uh, Kong, I'm doing good, man. Having a great one tonight. Just going through some books. Got some great stuff. Um... Chris, the building is for my comic shop, man. I actually am trying to start up a comic shop, a physical location. It's been something I've wanted to do for years. Uh, we do the online show right now, and it's just an online shop that I run out of my house. But really, man, the dream is to get a building and push this to the next level. I love, I love buying and selling comics. I, I love reading comics. I've been a part of them since I was a young kid. Um, it's just something I really love to do, man. I love talking with you guys about books. I love having you guys come in and, and talk books with me. I think it's a great experience. Um, so I love doing this, man. I absolutely love doing it. Uh, we still have a lot of slabs up here. Like I said, if anybody wants to get these eight specific slabs, I'll do a crazy deal on these and knock $130 off and do $1,000 for all eight. $1,000 for all eight, guys. So let me know if you want to grab those off me um thanks chris i appreciate it man getting rid of my pc to do this guys uh 1500 for this. this is a thor collection this comes with two slabs four thor keys and this entire short box of journey into mystery starting at number 100 and just going straight forward man into the silvers into the thor beautiful nice high grade thor there too man there's some nice stuff in here um, I do have some ASM, I think, but not real early. Um, yes, Kong. No problem, man. I totally understand how it goes, brother. Pay me when you can, my friend. Take care of your family first. Family always first. Not a problem. Uh, Adam, what's going on, buddy? Uh, I do have some crows set aside for you specifically. Isn't that cool? You know why I did that? Because that's the kind of guy I am. I did set some crow aside for you, buddy. For you specifically. You're going to eat crow. You're going to eat crow. <laughs> that's great. Look at these crows. I have at least one, two. Do I have any more? I thought I might have had some more. I know I have more, but I might only have two in here. I only have two in here for now, buddy, but do have these two in here. Let me know if you're interested. Crow number one and two. You want those? I'll do ten a pop on them, Adam. Let me know. Twenty bucks for the pair. Um, if I claim something today, just update the invoice. No problem, Kong. No problem at all, my friend. Like I said, guys, there's a lot of great stuff in here, man. I'm letting go of so much stuff out of my personal collection. A lot of high grade stuff. A lot of really high grade stuff. So if you see something that interests you, please let me know. I got some really nice books up here. Punisher number one, Nick Fury number seven, ASM 346, Venom cover, Kazar number one, First Battle of Hulk vs. Thor, Iron Man 3, 4, and 5, beautiful Silver Ages. We got stackers over here of Conan, Thor God of Thunder, Power Man Iron Fist, Captain Marvel stacker, man. Get yourself some nice bronze Captain Marvel at just $9 a pop on these. And most of these are Mylar and fullbacks too, man unbelievable avengers we got transformers beautiful thanos stack 60 bucks there's just six dollars a piece on these man and like i said feel free to throw an offer too guys if you see something and you might not be able to afford it you got, want to come down just a few bucks i will work with you let me know um how much on the asm on the rack uh the asm up here i think is 25 or 30 25 25 on that guy right there Beautiful high grade, 346, awesome classic Venom cover. Beautiful. Um, did you get any new Virgin? Yeah, right. On. I don't think I have any new ones, man. I got these two over here. Um, man, I think that might be it. And this guy up here, 
the Carnage Virgin. Uh, I got the Semi Virgin down here. That's the limited trade dress. Mm, man, I don't think I have a whole lot more as far as those right now, Kong. I got to grab more, man. Um, I do need to get some more of those. Venom, early Kate's run. Two, three, four, nine. How much for God of Thunder Stacker? Uh, the God of Thunder Stacker is 200 for 16 issues. Includes number one, second print, first print, and the Halloween Comic Fest edition. And several other issues. Does not have the gore in there. The big $100 <laughs> book is not in there. Um, but awesome run because none of these books right now are going for under 10 to 15 a piece. And there's a couple in there that are 20 to 30 a piece. So awesome right there. Um, let's see, Captain America 100 or Silver Surfer 4. I do have a 100, but I'm, ah, mm, I kind of really, I haven't priced it out yet. Uh, you might be able to message me about that one later, Josh. 35 on the ASM and the Crow books. Uh, yes. Yeah, I can do that. So 35 on the ASM and the two Crow books. And that is for Adam Richards. Um, yeah, sorry, Sam. I'm sorry you're getting the lag, brother. Um, my connection is just not the greatest here. Uh, Captain Marvel. Uh, Captain Marvel Power is 90 for nine issues for the whole stack. Nine issues there. Early issues. And then the Avengers stack is 80 bucks for 13 issues. Got that second Nebula in there, Yellow Jacket. I mean, there's some cool books in here, man. Nice bronze 183 on top. There's some cool stuff in these stacks, man. I'm telling you guys. Uh, what issues are Thanos of those? We've got number two, number six, uh, number seven, number eight, number 11, number 15 variant, 17 variant, 17 variant, 18 variant, and annual one. So, nice little run of the Stano's books. It's $6 a piece on those. Um, any Star Wars? I have two Star Wars. Sorry for the screen going blurry, Kong. I'm trying to keep it focused, but it likes to go in and out on itself. Uh, only two Star Wars books here. I have the figure variant right here for $10, and I also have this one for $10, the Star Wars Dark Empire 2, number one. Both higher grade. $10 a pop on those. Um, any other Christmas cover books? Yes. All these four are Christmas covers, and we have a whole stack of other Christmas books if you're interested, Eric. Let me know if you want to see more of those. Um, 90 on the Marvel. 90 on the Marvel. What was the Marvel? Captain Marvel? Oh, 90 on the Marvel. Um, Kevin, let me know if those, if you're claiming those, buddy. Um, or if you're answering somebody's question. I don't, I don't want to... Sell so you a stack of books accidentally, brother. Let me know if you wanted to claim those. Um, appreciate you, man. Let me know when you can pull out any other more crow you have. No problem, Adam. Can't tell from those racks. What's up, brother? What's up, Sam? What's going on, man? Um, can you please show me Avengers and Captain Marvel? Yes. So Captain Marvel has 24, um, 39. No problem, Kevin. That's why I asked, buddy. 44, 45, 48. 51, 52, 55, 57, awesome cover, uh, and 62. So a nice run of Captain Marvel there, man. Just 90 bucks on that stack. Ridiculous. Awesome deal. Nine bucks a book on those Cap Marvels. Some nice early issues in there, too. And then the Avengers... 80 on these, 13 issues in there. You got that first Nebula high grade, or excuse me, first, uh, what is this, first cam, or second, what is this, second Nebula, or Origin of Nebula, excuse me, Origin of Nebula, my brain wasn't working there. Origin of Nebula, um, got the Yellow Jacket, 319, then it's a mixed stack here of different Avenger books. Some Secret Wars, but also Avengers, Secret War Avengers. And why are these here? Those shouldn't even have been in here. This is Captain America stuff that should have been set to the side. I don't know why it's over here. Um, but yeah, that is the Avengers stack. 13 issues in there for 80. All right. 
Um, I'll take Thanos 2, 4, 6, and 11 if you have those. Uh, the Thanos I'm not breaking up. I do have 2, 6. I think I do have 11 in here. Yeah, and I have 11 in here, but I'm not breaking the stack up. If you want to get the stack, I'll do the stack, but I'm, I'm trying to keep all these together. Um, all the stackers are bundles. Uh, show more of the Christmas books when you get a chance. No problem. No FF52. Um, did you show them yet? Sorry, I froze again. Let me know, Sam, which, which things you were um, wanting to see. I did just show them, brother. Um, what saga do you have? I thought I saw some in the box. Saga. Any invaders? Yes, Jason. I do have some invaders, brother. Uh, I have like the whole run of invaders, in fact. High grade. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, six, or seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty twenty four. 2, 25, 24, 23, they're out of order, 26, 27, 28, 29, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, and 41. So pretty much the whole run of high-grade invaders. Uh, is that Thor? Yeah, God, Thor got a thunder stack. If so, how much? Congrats on opening the store. Anthony, haven't opened the store yet, brother. Working on it, but that's what the show's for, man. I'm trying to get the building together. Uh, 200 bucks on this. This has three variants of number one, first, second print, and the Halloween print. Um, also has a bunch of other various issues in there. 200 on that takes the stack, 16 issues. Couple of books in there, like 25, 30 bucks a pop. And nothing in here is under 10 to 15. Nice stack of books in there, man. Really nice. Um, show the cap stuff. Josh, man. I know, man. I know. The, the, the buddy that I have here helping me out with the show tonight is a huge Cap fan. I'm a big Cap fan. He got me more so into Cap, even more so than I was. But uh, the Caps are kind of off limit, but not totally. I do have some nice Cap stuff in here. Hold on. Let me show you these couple little... Where are they at? I know I do have a couple. Oh, actually, I think they're over here. Yeah, okay. So if you want to see some nice Caps... I do have some nice ones. I had the king size special number one, 75 on that. King size special cap number one. I have the giant size cap number one for just 10 bucks. Steel, $10 on that. Are you serious? Um, and I have number three, which I think also is, yeah, 10 bucks on that. That is a crazy deal on those guys. Seriously. I think it's also one of the that is ridiculous on those. Ridiculous. Um, Oh, okay. Uh, maybe he was talking about Cap Marvel. That's true. Uh, so if you're talking about, I was thinking the ones that you shoved under the rack there, that was on the bottom of the Avengers stack. You said all these are caps. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. You're talking about this stack. Um. Oh yeah, it's a little seven book stack of Captain America. Um. So if you're interested in this, this is a little seven book stacker of mixed Captain America stuff. Couple number ones in there. I think there's a cool little Steranko variant in there. Um. Just some of the mixed runs. Some great art on these, though, man. Beautiful Hydra stuff. Civil War. So, it's a little mixed lot of some caps right there. So, that stack for 37 issues. <laughs> all right. Uh, what's the character on the rack that's all the way to the left bottom? That is Catwoman. Catwoman. Um, oh, I thought you said six each. Uh, okay, no worries. What was, uh, what was he asking about, Devin? I didn't even see what he asked I about. Maybe I, I yeah, me neither. Maybe I missed the comment. Um, Katie, yo, invaders, why are you holding out on me? <laughs> Katie, I've got, yo, Katie, look, I've got so many invaders. I've got the whole run here, except for like two. So, and they're all like higher grade, all mylar up and in fullbacks. This is my PC stuff, guys. Like I said, I mean, these are these are nice. They're nice. There's a couple that aren't fullbacks, but a lot of these are in fullbacks. A lot of them are in fullbacks with Mylars. Um, but let me know. <clears throat> excuse me. Let me know on those if you need any of them. Um, yes. Yeah, let me know uh, if you guys want the uh, the invaders. 
Thanks, I couldn't see because the screen is blurry. That's weird, Kong. Is it blurry for anybody else? Has anybody else seen a blurry screen? Uh, I still think I got beat a while ago. Let me get back on this video. So, oh, that's funny. Uh, any more black cat virgins? Other than the ones that are up here, man. These are the only two that I have, guys. 30 and 35 on those. If you want to get both together, I'll do 60 on the pair. Um, would you happen to have DC Comics Presents 47 first <clears throat> He-Man? No, but I had the first Marvel Age He-Man, but it's not priced out yet. But I might throw that up next week, Mario. Shoot me an inbox message if you're looking for that. Um, what else do we have? I think only just once. Just messing with you. Eric J. Still in the room. Keeping all the books you claim now done. Um, if you have any Virgin of Venom, let me know. Thanks. It's got a Thunder tour in, two in the stack. No, if, the, if two in the, it was in the stack, it'd be a whole lot more money. Um, I know you, said you couldn't find them yesterday. Now I'm back. Okay. Uh, I'll take those caps you showed on top of the long box. Okay, so the three caps, uh, if you want all three of those, it's 95 for the trio. It's the number one king size, the number one giant size, and the number three uh, king size annual. So the number three, the number one, number three annual, and the number one giant size. Very nice stack right there. And who claimed those? It's 95 on those. For Joshua Conan. Okay. Yeah, he just bought for me recently, so I recognize that name. Okay. Uh, so 95 on those three to Joshua. Kevin said it's a little blurry. Pete said yes. Janet said yup. Dang, I think they are saying it's blurry. I don't know how to... It's weird because it shows really clear on my end, but... Um, real blurry, but not choppy. It's more pixelated, but that's just the nature of phone connection. Yeah. Um... It's blurry, it's pixelated, yeah, a little blurry, very blurry. Uh, can I see Invaders 2, 3, and 4? Black Cat Pair 50. Uh, Jason, yes. We'll do that, Jason. I'll give you the hookup, brother. No problem. Virgin Variant Pair to Jason Kloss for 50. Awesome pickup on those, man. Um, you want to see the Invaders 2, 3, and 4? Let me pop those guys out. So they are nice copies, like I said. Number two, these are right out of the PC. Uh, I think I think two does have a little bit of issue on the cover here. I'm trying to, yeah, see, it does need a pressing, but it's nothing that can't be pressed out. Um, nothing color breaking. As you can see, it doesn't break any color, but it does need a pressing. Um, there's the two, the three. Three is very nice. I mean, two is nice, too. It just needs to press, honestly. There's no color breaks on it or anything. It has some ticks going on. Two ticks, it looks like. But four. Little Nazi exploitation cover. Nice copy. And the prices on those is 20 20 and 20 So 60 bucks for the three. Awesome deal on those two, man. $20 a piece on those is nice for those high grades. Um, any spawn? I have a couple spawn. Invaders 7, 8, 9. Or 7, 9, 10. Yes, I have 7, 9, and 10. I have a 7. And a 9. And a 10. Whoa! She fell. You fell face first at least. Um, so seven, nine, and ten. You're looking at yeah, blurry phone connection is probably on 4G, not Wi-Fi. Yeah, yep, it actually is because the Wi-Fi was was not connecting. It wasn't staying connected. So at least this is staying connected for you guys. Uh, but Invaders 10, uh, 20 bucks on that one. The nine, 15 on that one, and the seven, 30 on the seven. So you're looking at, if you wanted all three of them, Katie, you're looking at 45, 55, 65 on those three. Um, if you want to do those three, I would do 55 for you on those three if you want to get them, Katie. Let me know on that. Um, yeah, blurry. You can't tell a book sometimes. That sucks. It's so blurry. I don't understand how it's blurry like that. Oh, it's so frustrating, guys. I'm, I, I'm, I, I do apologize for that. Uh, usually my show is not blurry, to be honest with you. Um, 
usually it's coming through very clear, but uh, apparently right now things are coming through kind of janky. I do apologize for that. That is not normal. Um, wait, did anyone else hear the duck in the background? <laughs> That's Howard. That's hilarious. Blurry on phone or laptop, so it's not phone connection. Um, blurry. Wait, did anyone else hear the duck in the background? <laughs> He was playing with the with the chick. Uh Janet Atterbury. He's using his phone network, not Wi-Fi. What saga did you have in the Oh Saga? When you asked Saga earlier, it I see it, it never dawns on me right away. You're talking about the indie saga. I always think Marvel saga. When somebody says saga, that's what I go to right away. I'm like, oh Marvel saga, but he was talking about the indie stuff. Um so I have like two saga books in here, man, I think. I think that's it. Yeah, I have two of them in here. I have number 11 and 12, I think. 11 and 12 are in here. If you want these, man, I'll do these for five bucks a pop. That's a steal on those high grade sagas at five a pop. Let me know if you want those. Um, what is the Kzar on the wall? Oh, that's Kzar number one. I also have the other number one as well. I think it's 30 on this one. Yep, 30 bucks on this guy. Nice high grade number one of the Bronze Age run. And then I also have the number one. I also have some of these Astonishing Tales with Kzar, if you're interested in Kzar. Um, and I also have... Where is it? Uh, there's the Astonishing Tales Kzar number one. But then I also have that one, Kzar the Savage number one. Two copies of it. Um, both high grade. So let me know if you're interested in those. Um, we do 70 for two, three, four, and five. Um, I think he's talking about the invaders. Let me see the five. Let me see what we got on the five. Um, so she wants the seven, nine, and ten. So that's 55 on the invader stack for Katie. And then Jason said 70 for two, three, four, and five. That would be 20, 40, 60, 80. So, yeah, I can do that. 10 bucks off. That's fair. That's fair. And you're getting a nice run, bro. Nice run. These are out of the PC, like I said, man. Nice. Two, three, four, and five. So, that's to Jason Sherrill for those, for the two, two through five of the uh, Invaders. And then... Um, those? Yeah. Uh, those were 70 for those to Jason Chereau. And then 55 for Katie for the ones in your hand. Close out porn hub. No, Rick. It will it will remain through the show. No. Uh, any Ghost Rider, Ghost Rider first editions? Uh, I don't think I have... Any of those, unfortunately, Danny. I can look through the, the Ghost Rider stuff. I do have some nice Ghost Riders in here, though. Um, deal on those. Okay, so Andrew Sabotnik is going to take these for 10 bucks for the pair, for the Saga pair. Um, then yeah, Andrew Sabotnik for those. Ten. Yep, for the pair, for, for both together. Um, and then any Carnage Virgins. Man, other than the ones I have up here, buddy, that's the only one I think I have is that one for 15 um, any Silver Surfer 44? No, I do have some Surfers in here. I have a 16, a 17, a 50, a 3 from the black with a reprint of basically a recreation of that classic um, SS4 cover. A uh, reprint of uh, Silver Surfer from in the Fantasy Masterpieces. And then this one right here, the Weapon Zero and Silver Surfer crossover. So not a ton of those. Um, Christmas books. Oh, yeah, yeah, you asked about this a while ago. So... Um, yeah, I do have a couple Christmas books up here. So I have this one right here, the Avengers Annual Number One, Dead of Winter, which is great because it has the Christmas Leahy, as I like to call them. And then we got the Deadpool Christmas, which is fantastic, complete with candy cane gun. Children, please do not operate the candy cane gun. You'll shoot your eye out. Um, so all those right there. Uh, what else do we have? No problem, Jason. Not a problem at all, buddy. Glad to see you back in here, man. Hope everything's been good with you. Hope you had a good Christmas. Hope everybody had a good Christmas, by the way. Merry Christmas to everybody out there that is celebrated recently across the globage. Katie's looking for 14, 17, 18, 19. Uh, I think I have them. I think I do have them. 
I'm missing one of them. That might be one of the ones I'm missing. Um, Jason Shrill wants to see the number six. Okay, so let me get number six out. And then 14. There's 14. 17. Bondage cover. Or nah, kind of bondage cover, right? Uh, semi. <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, 18 and 19. Okay, so... These are great covers, man. Gotta give the invaders that. They did have some fantastic covers, man. Crazy Nazi exploitation. There's nothing cooler than Captain America punching a Nazi in the face. <laughs> Hitler cover right there. Man, and these are high grade too. Um, so you got number 14, number 17, 18, or excuse me, 19 and 18. Uh, you're looking at 15, 30. 45, you're looking at 60 on those four, Katie. 60 on the four of those. Beautiful high-grade copies. Um, if you want to get all those, I'll hook it up and I'll do, uh, because you bought so much other stuff, I'll do 50 and knock 10 off of those. So call it 50 flat on the four if you want those four. The Avengers are old school. We know if you want those. Um, can I see Avengers? Oh, yeah, so here's the Invader 6, by the way. Um, beautiful number six, but it does, I think, have some water damage. Yeah, it does have some water damage very lightly up here. Um, but I don't think it goes through the book. It's more so just the cover here. It'll probably just be pressed out, to be honest with you. It doesn't affect the staples or anything. Um, doesn't go through the book even. It's just the first page, pretty much. But I'll leave that up to you, to your discretion on that one. It says just 14, 19. Uh, 14 and 19... Uh, 14 to 19 would be 30. I'll knock five off and do it for 25 if you want to get those two, Katie. Let me know if you want to get the 14 to 19. I'll do 25 on the pair. Uh, any Avengers old school or King in Black? Uh, no King in Black, but yes to the old school Avengers. Um, Seventeen or eighteen. 17 Let's see 17. PM, yeah. Can't seem to get this to work for me. I'll PM you with my PayPal info. No problem, Samuel. Not a problem, buddy. I'm um, calling good night. Thanks for the deals tonight. Appreciate you, brother. Not a problem, Andrew. Appreciate you coming in, checking out the show, man. Definitely appreciate it. Hope to see you guys next time. Uh, we still got a lot more books to show off here. Uh, no Vampirella or Lady Death at the moment. Um, no doubt, Jason. Hope everything's going good up there, brother. Enjoy that time with the family for sure. Uh, Deadpool Christmas, I could do 10 bucks on that one, Eric, let me know. Uh, who doesn't like a good bondage cover? Wonder Woman is all bondage. Yes, it is. That's so accurate. Wonder Woman covers, there is, there is probably more bondage on those covers or Wonder Woman associated covers than any other character, but she's also got a longer run. Rex wants to know what X-Men you got left. Mmm. I mean, there is some good ones. Um... The X Men. Okay, so yeah, X Men. Uh, we've got the annual four, five, seven, eight, nine, eleven, twelve, one forty six, forty seven, forty eight, forty nine, fifty special edition one, two sixty eight. Uh, the uncanny trade paperback. Uh, the one ninety nine first second Dark Phoenix giant size one reprint classic X Men one one thirty three reprint one seventy one one sixty four one fifty seven two twelve. King size special number one, 138, 244 first Jubilee, 211 Marauders border cover, and number four, the Omega Red as far as like key keys. Um, got the Heroes for Hunger number one in there. It's a fun little one. Katie says she'll take the four invaders. Um, I'll take all four. I might have Okay, so the four invaders was 50 for the four. Um... It was these four, or no, these three, no, these two, because it wasn't the six, yeah, these and these two, yeah, the 17 and the 18, those, okay, yeah, so 50 for all four of those. And then, what is she's a ghost writer, please? Um, Jason wants to know the price. The six the is 15, buddy, 15 for the six, uh, excuse me, 15 for the six, um, And then Katie, wait, Katie then said 25 for 14 and 19 better. 
I do not need 17 or 19. Okay. Um, We're trying to catch up, guys. Then said, so would you do 35 for Invaders 6, 17, and 19? Ooh. Just straight 30? Um, Is that what she said? No, I gave her 5 off on those. Um, 25 for those. Okay. It was 25 for those. Um, uh, what do you do? 35 for Invaders 6, 17, 19. Let me see. Oh, that's the ones that are out here. Wait, oh, the 17 and 19. Oh, that's the one she didn't want, right? That was the one she passed on? Yep. Katie passed on those? Okay, so Katie passed on those and the six. Oh, she wanted 14 and 19. I do not need the 17 or 19. What does she need? <laughs> Let's go back there. Hang on just a second. Well, I have the 17 and the 19, so she doesn't need those. She needed the other two, the ones that you gave her, I think. Yeah, those two. I, I, the 18 and the 14. 17, 18. 1914. That's what she said back here. I think she oh, mistyped. Man. Yeah. Oh man, now we're really confused. Help us. Help us, Katie. Yeah, 25 for 14 and 19. So she needs 19. So 19 is the one she should have got. Okay, the 19. Alright. Um, the Omega Red first appearance is... I think 30 yeah 30 bucks on that beautiful high grade copy mylord up full back out of the pc beautiful book um okay uh i keep the 14 and 19 i done broke the show uh so she keeps the 14 and the 19 is the ones that she wanted okay so then the 17 18 and 6 are still available jason let me know if those are the ones you wanted um how much did you Give him the Omega Red price. Yes. Did the Omega Red. Uh, let me know if you want those, Jason, on those invaders. And then we still got this Transformers up here. Got all these Furies. Whole stack of Silver Age Furies still. I've got all types of other Silver and Bronze Age goodies in here, guys. Like I said, just let me know. Avengers. Somebody was asking about Avengers earlier. Some old Avengers. High Grades. Some variants, some keys. Got first Nebula, first Hellcat, some of the annuals, some 1 in 25 variants, some Silver Ages. I mean, some nice ones. Um, he said, yeah, I'll take those for 35. Uh, man, uh, yeah, I could do that. I could do that because that's 45. Yep, that's fine. So 35 on those to Jason, no problem. Uh, we got you on that one, brother. Uh, what about the first Jubilee? I think Juby. I don't know exactly what I have her at, to be honest with you. I think she's around 40, 50, something like that. 40, 40 bucks. There we go, 40 bucks, high grade. First appearance, Jubilee. Beautiful copy. Out of the PC. Nice book, man. Very, very nice book. Um, keys. I asked for Avengers and mostly keys. Yeah, I have a bunch of Avengers in here, man, but not a whole lot of keys per se or big ones necessarily. Just some, some nice ones. Somebody asked about this Hellcat I see. Um, here's the Hellcat. Beautiful copy. 144. Avengers 144. Awesome book. 60 bucks on that. First Hellcat. First Jubilee. Two nice keys right there. Not first Hellcat. Um, yeah, yeah. First, uh, first, uh, yeah, Hellcat and Avengers, right? Yeah, first Hellcat and Avengers. Um, what is it? Uh, S Avengers, keys, Avengers, 150 or lower. Yeah, I got a whole bunch of those in there, uh, Pat. A bunch of those Avengers that are earlier. Um, Ghost Rider issues. Yeah, Danny, you asked about those a while ago, man. My bad on the delay on that, brother. Uh, Ghost Rider. Yes, here we go. Um, so we got a little, I think it's the Crane Ghost Rider. Then we got the 90s run with the number two. Then some of the nice first run 22, 23, 33, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. All higher grade. All beautiful high grade copies of those two, man. Fire. 
Uh, Janet, I do have a Batgirl stack. Um, I have a Batgirl stack that's not out here and assembled, but let me, um, let me private message you tonight after the show and I will shoot you, um, a picture of the stacker that I have of some, some Batgirl stuff. We'll work out a deal. Uh, no X-Men 134 had one, but got rid of it. It is an awesome Hellcat cover. Uh, I'll take those invaders for 35. Yes. Uh, we got you on those, Jason. You're good on those, brother. Um, first Patsy Walker was Miss America number two. If you want the OG first appearance. Yeah, that's, uh, that's prior to even the, um, well, Patsy Walker ran in the forties, right? The OG Patsy Walker. That was like a 10 center, wasn't it? Yeah. I just picked up a few of those. Yeah, that's a wild, long-running book right there, man. That's one that's just, it's got a hell of a history on it. Um, but these are awesome keys up here. Definitely got a lot more stuff in here, guys. Like I said, I still got some great, great X-Men, some Avengers stuff in here, some early ones. We got the 86, 80, 65, 79, 64, 59. We got the 1 in 25 variant, three copies of that. First Nebula, king size 8, uh, number 49. Uh, West Coast Avengers, number one, the modern number one, annual number nine, number five, number three, got a bunch of the uncanny number ones, yeah, that was timely, yes sir, Cash, I know that's your stuff, man, I know you love them golden age books, brother, um, I'll tell you a DC cover you probably know, what's that, just picked it up for Jewel, it's the Silver Age, Batman, where Batgirl's on the cover and she's got a run in her. Style. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's a popular. Yeah, that's an awesome one, man. I just picked that one. Yeah, up. that's such a great cover, man. That era, that whole era of books is just so good. I uh, got some beautiful Doctor Stranges in here, man. Some nice Silver Age Doc Strange, some Bronze Doc Strange, high grades. Uh, I do have a twenty nine, I believe. Do believe I have a twenty nine. Um, or is that one of the ones I'm missing? No, I have it. I do have a 29. I thought Miss America was Atlas Cash. Number 29. Nice copy, too, man. Nice, nice copy here. 29. 25 bucks on that guy. The number 29. Swastika cover. Teutonic Knight. Die, Allied Swine. What a great cover, man. What a great, great cover. Um... Yeah, that's an awesome one. What else do we have in here? Got a couple Virgin variants in here for 10 bucks a pop. Some hip hop covers. Phoenix One. Nice Marvel 2 and 1. Number 2. Some of the figure variants. Bunch of Warlocks. If there's any Warlock fans out here, got a nice little run of those. Excalibur. Machine Man, number 1. Um, what else do we have in here? Firestar. Hawkeye, number 1. Giant Size Doc Savage. Spirit of Vengeance. Uh, Virgin variant of, um, Virgin variant of, uh, what is that? Blade one, I think. That Wolverine versus Blade. Team America, number one. Micronauts, number one, because they're the Savage, number one. Um, yes. Yes, I will. 20 on 29. It is a deal because you grab some other books and that's how we roll. Uh, ugh, I had the issue. Yeah, he's gotten a nice stack of them, man. Um, uh, I have that. He's trying to get the full run. I've been, I've been hooking him up with the Invader stuff for a while because I think he got an Invaders one from us a while back, if I'm correct. Uh, I have that issue and it annoys me so much. Like, come on, Babs, the Batman is asking for help. Help the dude running your stocking. Sheesh. <laughs> Ain't got time for this for your poppy cocking and penny brushing, see? Um, but if you if you read those with the Batgirl when Batgirl started, she was more of that twist in the plot yeah she she got things done but sometimes she didn't exactly know what to do <laughs> yeah but it all worked out the formulation <laughs> the correct formulation the annual one yeah yeah you got both of those here i think that's a cool one first team up of power man and iron fist beautiful well, cover too annual that's the uh schoenberg alex schoenberg cover. yeah it's a great art on that one there um yes you got the invaders 29 buddy yes sir you got the invaders 29 faux show faux show uh some secrets of sinister house a lot of cool horror stuff left in here demon beware number eight number two devil dino second appearance of moon knight 
buck twenty five on that. War is hell. Uh, high grade, high grade second appearance at death. That's a nice sleeper book. Uh, Monster Frankenstein number five, number two, high grade. Adventure into fear. 16, 18, bunch of Godzillas, all high grade, even the low print run ones, all higher grade, nice copies, big old Godzilla run, some Werewolf by Knights, like I said, man, most of this stuff is out of the PC, guys, so a lot of higher grade books in here. Issue. I'm gonna get to that. Yeah, I'm gonna get. I just wanted to because I'm so close to the end. <laughs> I just wanted to finish going through the last couple. Um, I do have a McFarlane ASM. Give me just one second. I'll get to that. The Demon issue was number nine, and I think I got a dumb low price on this too. Yup, Katie, you're gonna want this. Ten bucks. Ten bucks on the Demon number nine. Uh, Secret Wars 10, I do not have number 10. That's a great cover, Jason, that Doom cover. I do not have that one, though, buddy. Uh, but, yeah, 10 bucks on the Demon. Uh, and as for that McFarlane, I'm going to leave this one out just in case Katie wants that. Um, as for the McFarlane Spider-Man, I do have at least one for sure. Um, I got Alex Ross. Beautiful carnageized virgin variants. I forgot I got those. Was he looking for the keys or just any of them? Uh, he didn't specify. This one's not a key per se. I don't think most of them are keys. I think there's only like one key. Or, well, there's a couple keys, but yeah. I uh, got this one right here. So Katie has got the demon for 10 bucks. $10 for a demon. I uh, got this ASM right here. I'll do 10 on this one if you want to grab it, man. I've got 18 on it, but I'll hook it up for 10 bro. Cause that's the kind of guy I am. We're hooking up deals here tonight, man. We're giving all kinds of deals. That's the kind of guy I am. Lethal Protectors number one variant. Absolute Carnage. Ghost Spider. Cult of Carnage. Typhoid. First meeting of Spider-Man and Spider-Woman. Lethal Protectors two. ASM anniversary book. First appearance of... Or is that... It's not first appearance of Spot. Something else is going on in that one. Um, so this one's... Uh, Actually worth a bit more than this in this condition. Unfortunately, though, it has two Todd from Spidey in it. So we don't know who Spidey is. Spidey could be the <laughs> actor. Yeah, right. Course. It's literally Spider-Man. Uh, it's likely somebody that played the actor or something. Um, but we don't have confirmation on it. But that is in there. Uh, Spider-Gwen, number eight. Ten bucks on that. Awesome Hobgoblin Virgin cover for just ten bucks. Can't go wrong there. Uh, original sketch on this one right here, $75 on that. That is that Clone Conspiracy, Dead No More, number one. Uh, number one on that variant of Carnage vs. Deadpool. Kirkham variant right here on the Carnage vs. Deadpool. Spidey 2099, number one. First appearance of Corona. Uh, part of the Craven Hunt, Spider Woman, number one. Spider Man Unlimited, classic cover, a couple ASMs. Got the Spidey, number one, McFarlane. First appearance of Spot, Peter Parker 100, Symbiote 1, ASM 129 reprint, beautiful, uh, spectacular number 90, classic cover, also very early Black Cat, um, few a ASMs, Lethal Protectors 1, and ASM Annual, awesome Iron Man and Spidey stuff, and I got that Carnage number 1 in there also, ASM number 1, ASM Proposal Issue, Revelation of Hobgoblin, some cool stuff in there. Um, Spider-Man, Spider-Woman meet. Oh yeah. Um, that one is 20. Awesome book. Great cover. Pretty clean condition. Um, if I could find it. Might have went, might have the other way actually. Yeah, I think it's further back this way. Yep. So much better having this stuff organized tonight. This, I'm so glad I did this. Um, saves so much time, like sifting through stuff. Uh, so here it is. Beautiful copy. Spider Woman number 20. First meeting. New stand. Very cool. 20 bucks on that. Let me know. Whoop, whoop. Um, 
See any Iron Man crash and burn? Uh, do not have any of those, Danny. I think I've seen some before, but I do not own any of those, buddy. Um, yeah, I'm not sure about those. What else do we have up here? Got these Journey to Mysteries. Uh, Iron Man 301. Uh, I do in my personal, but not priced out out here. Tell you what, Danny, shoot. That's something to shoot to my inbox. I'll make sure it's on the show next week, man. Always shoot your guys' requests to my inbox because I'll start making sure that every week I bring that stuff out for you. I'll have it priced out for the show. A lot of these books I have, I just don't have everything priced out already. Um, still, man, I can't believe nobody's interested in any of these Furies that are up here. I've got some really cool Hawks in here. Uh, some Bronze Age Hawks, some She-Hulk number ones I've got a couple of. The Todd McFarlane Hulk cover. The Hercules homage. The Craft reprint of number one. Um, 25 on that uh, Blade vs. Wolvie Virgin cover, buddy. Uh, I will take SW20, please. It's one I've been searching for. It's a great book and a great cover. Spider-Woman 20 for Katie. Awesome, awesome book there, Katie. Um, really good copy too. Fantastic one. Uh, one of my favorites as well. My girlfriend's a huge Spider Woman fan. Spider, all the female characters, right? Like all the the female heroines, like uh, Spider Woman and Miss Marvel and She Hulk and all the fantastic, you know, characters throughout Marvel. She's a big fan of all those. So, um, got some nice early Iron Man's in here still. Number 11, 20, 28, 29, 30, 33. 44. It's high grade, super duper high grade, near mint, no no issues. I'll pop it out and, and grab it. I'm trying to think of where I got it though. Um I think that might actually be in here. Yeah. Um Machine Man one, Champions one, bunch of warlocks. Just naming out some stuff as I go through it. So you guys, Gamora Venomized, first meeting of Cap and Black Panther, Gamora 1, Guardians 1, Red Sonja 1, Morbius 1, Angela 1, some Virgin Variants, there we go, there it is, I think I actually have two of these left actually, I'm pretty sure I have two of these, beautiful copy though man, as you can see, nice high grade. That is the uh, the bag that looks like that too. Let me let me push her up so you can see. Hold on. There we go. Does have some issue here in the corner, but that bag really made it look really jacked up. But clean copy, man. Twenty five on that. Um, that's funny cash terrible no problem danny not a problem at all man um all right so what else do we have up in here luke cages a couple nice keys first claire temple high grade first meeting of uh power man and iron fist in the run 75 nice little mini key right there Nice run of these from the 60s and 70s, all higher grade. Got that Power Man Iron Fist number one figure variant cover. Nice, super high grade Iron Fist run. Beautiful. Includes a reprint of the 14. If anybody wants to get those together, do a bundle deal on those. A lot of this Silver Age stuff, man, if you guys want to get them together, I will hook up a bundle deal on them too. I have so many different stacks of of Silver Age and Bronze. I got all these Novas. I haven't even shown these off tonight. Nice run of high-grade Novas. Like I said, these are all like Mylar'd up, full-backed up, high-grade. They're all from the PC, guys. Like, these aren't low-grade beater books. They're all nice copies for the most part. There's a couple mid-grades here and there, but mostly all high-grade stuff. Virgin variants. Those are beautiful. 30 a pop on those. 801. ASM 129 homage on the Spider Girl 4. Beautiful cover, man. 
Clone Conspiracy 1, ASM Doom 11, Homage, um, Spider Woman 1, Peter Parker, Miles Morales 1, Variant Edition of the Carnage Eyes, Morales, Symbiote Spider Ron Lim Variant number 1, Symbiote uh, Spider Man Absolute Carnage number 1, ASM 302, McFarlane cover, Lethal Protectors number 1 variant, just a lot of great Spider Man stuff. Um, all the Why horror stuff. Not, yeah, I know. Like, what? What are you looking for? What? What do you? What do you want to see? I'm not. I'm not getting any feedback on what people are looking for. I'm wondering if they're there. Uh, Transformers. I know, right? I feel like I'm talking to a wall. Are you locked up? Oh man. Um, I'm seeing things on my end. Uh, can't remember if we checked Nova three six or twenty five. Yeah, I think we did. I do not have those. I have almost every other issue except those. Uh, the Transformers, got some Miss Marvels in here, forgot about those, two, three, four, five, six, all higher grade, some cool Wolvie books, Deadpool Kills Wolvie, Claremont Trade, Doc Stranges, high grades for a lot of these, some signed books, Prometheus, Huck signed, Flash Gordon Virgin, Highlander Ones, um, Xenoscope 1, some Turtles 1-Shot, Darker Image, First Appearance of Max, Barbed Wire 1, Sam and Twitch, if you're a Spawn fan, some Early Johnny Quest, Simpsons, Transformers 1s, Terminator 1, Rasputin 1, some cool indie stuff, some Surfers, beautiful cover right there, that variant. Um... I don't have any of the later ones in here. It's just the early ones right now, Katie. Uh, I might have some of those, but not out. Um, but you can always shoot me a message if there's specific ones you're looking for that you don't see out here. Shoot me a message, and we can work something out. Um, I can always message you after the show, right? So, um, I can't believe there's one left in the box. I know that we sold a boatload of them. Those giant size. I think this is the only one left, right? 35 bucks on that. Number three. Pretty nice copy too, man. Awesome, awesome art. There's nothing like a werewolf stealing your chick. <laughs> Saw your girlfriend there. Now I'm going to transform into a wolf and tank her. <laughs> and what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Real question. Somebody transforms into a werewolf and takes your girl. Well, <laughs> it was good while it lasted. <laughs> like, there's nothing you can do. She's going to Transylvania. Awesome cover though. Um, okay, don't sell anything for two minutes. No problem. Number three there. What else? We have a bunch of other Werewolf by Nights are still in here, man. And if you guys want to get some of these together in a bundle, any of these books, let me know. Godzilla. I mean, I've sold a bunch of stackers of this stuff tonight. I didn't even intend to sell these as stackers because these are all high grade um, and they're nice bronze and silver books. So these were intended to be sold as individuals. But if you'd like to get a stacker of some of this stuff, um, I have no problem assembling a stack of, of runs or characters, so um, you know, let me know. Let me know. Uh, pull the Silver Surfer stack. All right, so Silver Surfer is not a whole lot, admittedly so. Um, do have that beautiful cover right there. That is the Mephisto and Surfer Battle. I think it's 75. Yeah, 75 on that. Number 17, I think we got 50. Yep, 50 on that one. Uh, the number 50 is 20. I think it's 25. Yeah, 25 on this one for the variant. That's a great cover, though, man. Uh, this one right here is 30 on the uh, Silver Surfer high grade of the Fantasy Masterpieces. And then this one right here, I think it's just 5. Yep. 219.97. I don't know what that date means. I don't know if that's the release date. Um, but yeah, 219.97. $5 on that one. So. Let me know if you're interested in those. If you'd like to get a bundle deal on those, I'll show them fan out. Um, there's two volume one runs. There's a volume three. There's a fantasy masterpieces. There's one from the modern run. And then there's an image, um, basically appearance of him. And this uh, Silver Surfer and Weapon Zero number one crossover from Top Cow, Image, and Marvel. So... Like I said, you're looking at 75, 50, um, is this 20? I think it's 20 on this one. Yeah, 20. Uh, oh man, 
10. I think that's 20 as well, and I think that's 30 and then 5. Yeah, so let me know. Uh, if you want to get them all together, I'll cut a deal for you, Danny. Um, or if you want to get even just a couple of them together, let me know. I'm always hooking up deals <laughs> on stuff, man. Um, so you look around for a shiny vampire. I don't know, not the glitter vampire. Uh, call the side check. That's funny. Okay, number two, you're in. Yeah. <laughs> But yep. Uh, so, oh, Submariners. I forgot I had these in here too, guys. Uh, Submariners 64, 65, 66, 68, 70, 71, 72. All high grade. Almost all in Mylars and fullbacks. Uh, some more Moon Knights too. Special edition number three. Number two. 13, 12, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, and number five from the newer run. Uh, volume three. Also got the special edition of New Mutants number one, the reprint of First Cable, number 99, nice homage cover, uh, first cameo of Legion, or excuse me, first full appearance of Legion, first cameo of Legion, both high grade, and first X-Force. Uh, another special edition, special edition, number seven and 20, just great art on those early high grades. Also have the Daredevils, number 15 high grade, number 17, number 19, uh, number 24, I wonder if Daniel Martin's still out there. Number 25, number 26, beautiful key right there. First Blackheart, beautiful high grade. Number 48, 115, that's a really slept on key. Uh, the real first appearance of Wolverine. First advertisement. Uh, number 16, first John Romita art, classic art cover too. That was only in three comics as far as I know. Yeah. The Wolverine. Yeah, the ad, yep. Uh, Conan 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 60, 61, 63, 66, and the Exiles. And most of those are all higher grade. Like I said, guys, tons of great books up here still. Surfer, Daredevil, New Mutants, Iron Man, Captain America, Thor, Star Wars, Luke Cage, Hard Titles, Spider-Man, Venom, Punisher, Alpha Flight, uh, X-Men, Avengers, X-Force, X-Factor. Uh <sighs> Invaders, Nick Fury, Transformers, Blade, Iron Man. I mean, I got keys up here for days still. Yeah, we got this high, uh, the the early early issues of Iron Man. It's so quiet in here. Everyone, stop talking. Iron Man three, four, five. First battle of. Thor and Hulk right there, man. That's an awesome one. Kazar number one, Punisher number one, Nick Fury number seven, uh, Virgin Variant Carnage, Batman Who Last number one, Perillo Variant, Hulk uh, King Size Special, got that Catwoman Christmas Virgin Variant. Uh, how much is the Daredevil Wolverine you just mentioned? Daredevil Wolverine. The ad. Oh, uh, I think that's, man, that, that's a actually a pricier book. Um, I'm not sure the price on it. I want to say it's around like 40 or 50 or something like that. Um, I can't remember myself. I want to say it's around that area, area and price. Oh, I don't have a price on it. Oh man. Uh, that's around where I think it was supposed to be at, but you know what? We'll be nice and go on the low end and just say 50. Uh, cause I think it was supposed to be 55 actually, but I'm not positive. It was 50 or 55. Um, uh, that was on this one. So we'll say 50. 50 on that. Beautiful high grade. Awesome, awesome art. Beautiful copy. 50 bucks on that one. Let me know on that Daredevil. Um, didn't find any of the Night Nurse, did you? No, I did not find any of the Night Nurse, brother. Uh, to be honest with you, I haven't bought a whole lot of co collections recently. Um, no price means it's free, right? Exactly. <laughs> you get this for nothing. No, let me not say that. Somebody be like, hey man, I really expected that book for free. <laughs> I can't do that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, we have this Hellcat up here, the 144. And Jubilee, it's ironically, it's the 244. That's funny. <laughs> I didn't even realize putting the two female appearances up there together. Um, still got that beautiful Blade vs. Wolby up there for 25. A stack of Nick Fury Silver Age up here. Still got the slabs as well, guys. I haven't showed anything outside of the key box for a while, so people that are just tuning in or just checking out, I haven't seen the other stuff. We do have some slabs. We have some Golden Age goodies over here. Got another signed 9-8 slab. Got some Masters of the Universe Spider-Man, Alien and Predator, Daredevil, 
You got paid pools available, spins on the wheel, a lot of cool stuff up here on the rack, bunch of different keys, silver and bronze age. Got stackers over here, Captain Marvel, Transformers, Thanos, Conan, Thor, Power Man, Iron Fist, Avengers, Captain America, all kinds of good stackers, guys. All types of nice stuff over here. And not to mention, boom, 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 boom. A whole bunch of more slabs over here. Eight more Thor slabs and Journey into Mystery with some nice keys. Higher grade, we're talking 9-0s, 8-0s, 7-5s, 8-0s. Got two 5-0s in there. The older issues, the silvers with the Journey into Mystery. Beautiful stuff, though, man. Um, just some really, really great books. Uh, Thor number 30, beautiful stuff. Thor number 31, just some really, really great books. Avengers, Transformers, all types of cool stuff, man. It got really quiet in here. By the way, guys, uh, since we're down to just 20 heads, do us a favor. Share this out. Post it to groups. Share it on your page. Tag friends in it. Invite people. Please, please, please share this out. Yes. Walk 500,000 miles. Please share this out. We definitely appreciate all the love, guys. Uh, some Vault of Evils, Tomb of Darkness, Worlds Unknown, Chamber of Darkness, Tower of Shadows, Werewolf by Nights, Godzilla's, uh, Man Thing, Monster Frankenstein, War is Hell, Second Moon Knight, some DC stuff, some Modern Horror, Luke Cage, Power Man, Iron Fist. Um, I can keep you happy, but I keep breaking the show. That's funny. Um, what else do we have up here? I gotta get this daredevil back in the box. Well, I gotta, first off, all right, uh, so I don't think he wants to grab the surfer stuff. I'm gonna put those back. One over all the surfer stuff. Nobody was interested. So put those back in. Then we're gonna take this daredevil and pop this guy back in as well. Do have some really nice daredevils in here though, guys. High grade, number 15, oh man, number 17, 19, 24, beautiful Kazar cover, some really nice ones. Uh, the Moon Knight, I'll show the second Moon Knight, man. It's definitely not a high grade, it's a mid grade, does have some issues, there is a little writing on the cover. Um, I don't know why I'm looking over here for Moon Knight, uh, but I will show it to you. Is it in here? Or did I... No, it's, it's actually in with the horror stuff, because it's, oh, that's right, because it's Werewolf by Night, Durr. Um, so let me get to the Moon Knight. There it is. Number 33. Like I said, it is a mid-grade copy. It does have some issues. Got 125 on that. That is a super hot book, though, man. Super duper hot book. Uh, I actually have both of those, Katie, but not priced out. But I will bring those out um, next time, for sure. Uh, Daredevil 15. Man, that's a beautiful one, Pepe. Uh, I don't remember what I got on this bad boy. It's a beautiful copy, though. 35 What a steal on this one, man. That is a nice copy of that for $35, guys. That is a beautiful copy. Daredevil, number 15. And men shall call him Ox. What a great, great <laughs> cover, man. $15 on that one for the big Ox Galoot. What a great one. Awesome. Take DD, so 35 bucks to Pepe on that. What a great pickup, man. Um, got that 17 in there. Awesome Spidey and Daredevil cover. The 19, the 24 with Kazar. 25, 26, little Stiltman action. First Blackheart, 48, another Stiltman. First John Romita cover and that first 181 ad. Some great Daredevil keys in there. Um... What else do we want to look at in here? The Venom, the Spider-Man. Uh, we looked at the X-Men, I think, that were in here. Don't have a Shogun Warriors 1. Already sold that one, Katie. She gone. Um, still have some great X-Men keys in here, guys. A lot of X-Men stuff still left in here. Some X-Forces. X-Force number two, first appearance of Weapon X, um, second Deadpool, first appearance of Archangel, 35 bucks, nice high grade, X-Factor one, X-Factor border cover, number four, three, and two, so I actually have one through four in there, so nice stuff there, uh, Astonishing Tales, I have a whole run of these if anybody's interested, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, twenty-two, um, 24, 27, 31, 33, 
Then I got some Master of Kung Fu's. 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 81, 82, 83, all high grade. Defenders 2, 11, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 24, and Annual 1. Nice clean copy. Some Captain Marvels. Uh, 44, 54, or 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 61, 62. Man, uh, I do have two Adventures into Fear in here. Uh, only two of them, though. It's the only two that I even owned, actually. Uh, I think it's 40 on that, or 45, I think. Let me double check. Let me double check. 40. 40 bucks on the Defenders 2. And it is a nice copy, buddy. Very nice copy out of the PC. We got a gorgeous number three in the collection of these buttons. Did you? I don't think I've even had a number three before, to be honest with you. It does have a little issue down here at the bottom. You can hit that with a, a pick, though. The paper is still there. I just didn't want to take any risk with messing with it. Um, beautiful number two, though. 40 bucks on that. And then the Adventures into Fear. Just trying to get to those. Where are those at? I, think, I feel like they're in the... Yeah, they're here. They are. All right, so the Adventures of the Fear are 20 and 25 on those. 20 and 25 on the Adventures of the Fear, 16 and 18. So 45 on the pair. Um, Katie, if you want the pair, I would do 35 on the pair and knock 10 off for you. Uh, if you want to get these, 35 on the pair. Just let me know on those. Um, all right, where was I? I was going through the Defenders. Captain Marvels. Went to <coughs> so I got a bunch of these team ups and two in ones. Huge monster run of team up and two in ones. If anybody's interested in getting some of these, trying to fill in your runs, I have a lot of high grade ones. These are all from the PC, so pretty much every one of them is super high grade. Really nice. Some of these are worth more than I thought, to be honest. Oh, first Mockingbird is a nice one. Nice little key one. Yeah. Um, there's some really nice ones in here, though, man. Really high grade. Nice key issues. Big run. That's a great one, the 128. That's that background with the cap and Spidey. Uh, don't have the 141, man. Do not, unfortunately, do not have the 141. Was Katie looking for the man thing or the Morbius issues? Uh, I'm not sure. Just it out yeah, I'm not sure. Let us know, Katie, if you were looking for the man thing or the Morbius stuff. First time stone. That's an awesome one. Awesome one. Um... Um, first Mockingbird, uh, where'd she go? What is that? The what number was that? The one, or is it a, it's a 90, right? No, is it? Is it 94? No, not 94, 95. Yeah. No, it was around there. Um, we got 60 on the Mockingbird first appearance. High grade, beautiful copy, awesome book, newsstand, very nice, very, very nice, great vibrant color, awesome cover, cool first appearance, great high grade copy, straight out the PC, uh, what else do we have, went through the Defenders, went through the Marvel Age, I mean the Marvel team up and the two in ones. Okay, no problem. No problem, Katie. Uh, what else we got here? They got the She-Hulk ones. That's a really cool one. That Hercules, Hulk homage, Craft Hulk one reprint, Indestructible Hulk one, Hulk one, 209s. I have like 100 of these for some reason, all high grade. Uh, king size annual 8, 9. Uh, the special number 4. That's an awesome one. Some Iron Man's, all the early Iron Man's, some early Thor of the Kate stuff. Also some gems. Have a couple early gems and Thors in there as well. First Fire Lord is in there. Nice high grade copy. 257, 263. Some nice bronze Thors. 300. The border issue. 
Del Mundo variant. Uh, first appearance or cameo appearance of Carl Spoons. Carl Spoons cover. Uh, cap 600. Sensational Shield. 700 variant. Uh, the Sensational She Hawk was, I think, five or six. Six. High grade number six. Let me know if you need that one. I just picked up two Savage She Hawk number ones. Yeah, right? <laughs> you got me with those. They did look legit. I said, wait a minute, those are... Yeah, really? Yeah. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised, to be honest with you. Um, like I said, guys, got some great stuff up here still. And I'm still sitting on this Thor collection, man. I'm really surprised that nobody's pulled the trigger on this. Like, this is a steal of a deal. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Um, yeah, if you guys want to get this and make a payment plan on it, uh, we were talking about this, actually. I'll do six various payment plans on this one. And let me know which one will work for you. If you can afford the 1500 we can do that. I can break it into two and do 750 We can break it into uh, thirds and do 500 We can break it into, um, what was it, uh, sixth, right, was the last one. We can do it into six payments and do six payments of, what, 250 yeah, six payments of 250 Now, what this includes is the Journey into Mystery 100, the 116, 117, 122. And yes, uh, Pepe, I got you on that for the Mockingbird for 50 No problem on that, brother. Um, we got the Thor 131. We got the 141, the 150, awesome Hello cover, 157 Ragnarok. 159 with the giant 209 oh man and then on top of that you have these four over here uh second beta ray bill throg border book uh first cat wielding molnir first high evolutionary and the nine six bronze age all that all the keys the whole shorty full of uh silver and bronze thor plus both the slabs yeah, all the slabs, the keys, and the whole uh, short box, fifteen hundred, and that is on Flex Pay. If you want to get grab that for yourself, um, most things do have a a, 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 yeah, a payment plan, Chris. Uh, depending on what you're grabbing, let me know. Uh, pretty much most items will have a payment plan, especially if it's a larger purchase. Just shoot me a message um, privately if you if you have want more details about that. Uh, but we will allow uh, payment plans for larger purchases. The larger the purchase, the longer I'll allow the payment plan to go. Uh, there is a minimum amount you would have to pay every week if you have uh, a large purchase, but um, we'll work that out once we figure out exactly what the purchase is because it does vary depending on the purchase amount, um, what would be due each week. But yes, we do do payment plans for sure. Uh, Power Man, Iron Fist Stacker, Conan, Thor, God of Thunder, Thanos, Transformers, Captain Marvel, Avengers. Oh, man. Um, no, it is not. I have two sets of them. I have two sets of them. Two sets of them. We're selling them every day. Yeah. I actually had three sets of them, to be honest with you. Sam, what's going on, buddy? Um... Just in time to see me show this off here, buddy. I don't know if you saw this earlier, but fifteen hundred for this, and I am doing flex pay on this. That's for both of the slabs, all four of the keys, an entire short box full of silver and bronze journey into mystery, starting at one hundred, and yeah, all Thor and journey into mystery, all silver and bronze. Some nice high grades in there, a lot of early ones. Awesome, awesome stuff. So all that. Both of those and all these fifteen hundred on flex pay. That's a nice lot right there. Huge monster Thor collection. Um, got a couple other slabs over here, and got the Liberty Comics nine eight. Got these two bad boys for a hundred a pop on these Golden Ages, and then we've got these over here. Now I don't know if you caught this earlier, Sam. You were asking about these slabs and about the prices. We priced all these out, and it was one thousand one hundred and thirty for these eight slabs. Eight high grade golden, I mean, eight high grade silver uh, aged slabs in here. We priced it out at eleven thirty, but we could take a thousand flat. I'll knock a hundred and thirty off of them if you want to get all eight of them together. Let me know if you're interested on that, brother. I'll knock a hundred and thirty off of all of them. So that's a thousand flat for all eight slabs. You got 
three eight O's in there. You got a two seven fives, a nine O, and two five O's with multiple keys. First full appearance and cameo of Ego. You got the battle between Odin and Thor. You got an awesome Galactus cover. It's a nice journey into mystery and a nice 9-0 in there, man. Very, very cool. Very nice lot. Especially for a Thor fan, man. It's like an instant Thor collection, really. Um, some other nice stuff up in here, too. Uh, I was going to stab you in your eye. Oh, please don't stab me in the eye. Um, <laughs> yes, Samuel, we do ship to Canada, buddy. Absolutely. We do global shipping. We ship everywhere in the world. Uh, we have Werewolf by Night 33, Second Moon Knight. We have a big old stack of um, Nick Furies here. Uh, Sam, the only thing that I do have to say about that, though, buddy, keep in mind that all our prices are U.S. dollars, um, not Canadian dollars. So just keep that in mind when you're when you're claiming things, bro, um, because I know there is a conversion rate. Um, and that goes for anybody claiming from other countries. Just keep that in mind, guys, that there is conversion rates on things, and the prices that I'm giving is for U.S. dollars. Um, okay, so like I said, got a bunch of beautiful Thor slabs, some Golden Age stuff, some stackers over here, some Daredevil, Alien and Predator, Masters of the Universe. Man, I can't believe nobody snagged these high grade Masters of the Universe, Ron. No He Man fans? And these are the original ones, man. The Star Marvel stuff. These are nice. And they're clean, and it's a consecutive run. And the price is nice. Plus, it has the DC Universe versus Marvel, uh, DC Universe versus Masters of the Universe run one through six in there. And some of the other modern stuff, plus one through, or excuse me, two through eleven of the modern or the original run, and nobody's nobody's pulling them. So surprised. No Mortal Kombat stuff. No Mortal Kombat. Um, looking at the clock, we don't have a ton of time left, guys. We're at less than an hour left in the show. Um, it is about twelve twenty. We typically go off at one in the morning, so. We're going to keep this rolling for a little while longer, but get those claims in, guys, because we don't have a ton of time left in the show tonight. Uh, a little less than an hour at this point. So we're going to keep showing some stuff, but like I said, just keep that in mind. We are getting limited on time. Uh, so we've got the Thanos stacker here, Transformers, Captain Marvel, Avengers, Power Man, Iron Fist, Conan, Thor, uh, God of Thunder. Got all these Christmas books. Beautiful and Incredible Hulk, King Size Special number three. Yes. Uh, the price is on the black banner. So you've got spin the wheel is five for one spin, two for eight, three for 12, four for 15, five for 18. Uh, white box is one, yellow, three, red, five, blue, 10, green, 25. Pick a number one for three, two for five, three for seven, five for 11, or 10 for 20. And we also offer mystery boxes as well. Uh, the copper tier is 50, bronze tier 75, silver tier 100, gold tier 150, platinum tier 200. That does not dictate or indicate the um, books that we throw in there. You don't get, uh, you know, a box full of golden age books for 150, obviously. Um, but it, it dictates the level of value that we put into the books. Um, so... Uh, can you show the price? Yeah, I just want to know how much shipping is going to be, depending on that. Um, can I PM you to add more stuff? Yes, absolutely. Uh, shipping is more to Canada, brother, uh, but it's not terrible. I ship to Canada a lot because I have a, quite a few customers that, that ship to Canada. It is a little bit more, but it's not too, too bad. Um, but yeah, shoot me a message, man. Uh, definitely shoot me a message and we can chop it up more about that. And if you want to add some stuff to the order, we definitely can. Um, the mystery boxes vary. The small ones, the copper and the bronze have 25, the silver and the gold have 30, and the platinum has 35. So you get more books and higher level books as you go up in box size. And they are curated custom. So what you can do is you can send me a list of characters you like, and we'll put in those characters specifically. That way you're not getting a box of stuff you don't want. Because that's not what I do when I do mystery boxes. I put nice books in there. Um, so we got Iron Man 2, 3, and 4 up here. Somebody wants to get a bundle deal on those, let me know. Got this classic key right here. Thor vs. Hulk first battle. Kazar number 1. Punisher 1. Nick Fury number 7. Um, the Thor vs. Hulk is 175. Now, I know that sounds crazy because it's a beat up copy. But I'm telling you, man. These are selling for like 200 at 2.5 and 2.0. And this is beat up, but I would put this at higher than a 2-0. 
Um, I w- I'm not sure what I would put it at, to be honest with you, but I don't think it's quite a 2-0. Um, but yeah, this book is going f- selling, not going. I'll, I'm not even going to say going. It's selling on eBay for like 200 at 2-0, 2 Crazy low grade. Unbelievable. But 175 on that one. Um, can I spin the wheel? Looks cool. Absolutely, Sam. Uh, let me know how many spins you want to get. It is one spin for five, two for eight, three for 12, four for 15, or five for 18. All types of goodies on that wheel too, my friend. All types of goodies on there. Really, really cool to get get that uh, that spin rolling, man. I'm not going to lie. There's so much good stuff to win on there. I uh, still got these awesome defenders. Nick Fury, second Moon Knight, Virgin Variant, Transformers. Some nice keys up here. Some good stuff. Double spins. So eight bucks on that. Two spins for Sam. Dun, dun, dun. Boom, gift. Very nice for the first one. And for the second one, why should it be another gift? Another nice one, dude. Wow, what a hella nice two spins. So minor key and a gift. So we're going to go ahead and pull a gift from over here. And this will go with his order. And that is for Sam. And then he also has a minor key. So we're going to go ahead and... Dig into here, and how about we throw you a, let's see, that's a cool one, man, that's a really cool one, actually, it's a $15 book, too, Uh, we'll give you this one, brother, that's more than you just paid for the two spins, X-Men vs. Hulk number one, one shot, 70th anniversary cover. Awesome, awesome book, man. So, yeah, you got yourself like $20 worth of books for 8 bucks. Can't go wrong with that wheel, man. I'm telling you guys, that wheel is on fire. Uh, what else do we have here? No problem, buddy. Uh, we have the Store Stacker, the Conan, Cat Marvel. I can't believe nobody's pulled the, the trigger on the Cat Marvels. These are nice, too, man. 57, 55, 52, 51, 48, 45... 44, 39, 24, all that for 90. Or thought offer, guys. That's another thing, too. Don't hesitate to thought offers, man. These prices aren't set in stone. Um, these prices are, you know, fair according to, to last sales and all. But at the same time, I'm also willing to work with you. So if there's something you see that you're interested in or you want to work a deal or you've already grabbed some stuff, let me know and we'll definitely work out a deal. Uh, four spins for Pepe. So that is 15 bucks. So first spin for Pepe is going to be Minor Key. What a great way to start, man. Um, Gift for the second spin. Grinch. So Grinch is nothing for that spin, but you still have one more spin. Make your fourth spin. And Villain Book. So what do you have, a gift? Was there a gift? Yep. Yep. So a gift... Boom. So that goes to him. And then a villain book. We're going to pull. Hmm. I might have to go down here for a villain book. And what was the other one? Minor key. Minor key. All right. So how about for the minor key, we'll hit you with this Nick Fury number one. This guy here. Nick Fury of S.H.I.E.L.D. number one for your minor key. And then what was the other one? The villain book. And for the villain book, we're going to go ahead and go with... How about... Everybody's probably like, now he's going to show the DC stuff. Uh, How about we go with... Man, that's a tough one. Oh, here we go. This is a great one for a villain book. Deathstroke. Deathstroke's a great villain. A little Deathstroke action on the semi virgin variant covers. Um, best price on Captain Marvel. Uh, you talk about that stacker, Sam? The stack here? If you're talking about this, I got 90 on it, which is a steal already, honestly. That's $9 a piece on early Captain Marvels. Um, but I'll, I'll drop it down because you bought so much other stuff tonight, bro. I'll go down 20 on this one. Usually I'd only drop 10 on that. I'll drop 20 on it and go down to 70 
if you want that stack. So just seven dollars a piece on those. That's a steal on those, dude. And some of these are mylars and fullbacks too. So, like I said, some of these are PC books. So, seventy bucks takes that stack. If you want to grab all those, buddy, let me know. Ten books in there. Seven dollars a pop of them cat marbles. That's a crazy good deal. Most of these I've priced out around twenty to thirty bucks a piece for the other issues that I have as singles. Uh, Thanos is a nice stack right here. Um, Alex, what up, man? There's a couple stacks left, bro, and I'm throwing out good prices right now because we don't have a lot of time left in the show. Uh, I'll take it. Okay, so Sam is going to go ahead and get the Captain Marvel stack. I'm surprised that one took so long to sell, to be honest with you. Uh, 70 bucks on the Captain Marvel stack. Awesome deal, man. Um, Pepe said, Captain Marvel claim. Too late, Pepe. That one just sold, buddy. Uh, Samuel just took that one. But I do have more Captain Marvel stuff if you're interested, I think. Yes, I do. Uh, number 25, 44, 53. These are even earlier, and these are really nice. Really nice high-grade ones. So let me know if you want to get a bundle of those together, man. Um, uh, what's in Thanos' stack? Number 2, number 6, number 7, number 8. Number 11, number 15 variant, number 17 variant, another variant of 17, number 18 variant, and annual number one. Monster stack of those, man. Six bucks a pop on those. Awesome deal. Um, okay, I want five spins on the wheel. Give me some good spins. Okay, so Janet wants five spins, so that's 18 for Janet. What's up? Oh, you got to get caught up. Uh, so first spin, free shipping. No. Now, let me explain this uh, just so everybody knows. Free shipping uh, is only for in-country. If you are out of country, um, we'll, we'll reimburse you for the shipping. To we'll, we'll figure something out. for. We'll either give you another spin or something else because free shipping to out of country on a mid-sized box is like $60 sometimes. So obviously, we can't afford to do free shipping for international. Um, but we'll do up to a large box, up to $20 shipping um, for in-country orders or apply up to $20 to your international order. We can also do that as well. Um, so free shipping is the first spin. And then second spin, $5 on the Craven Cash. Awesome. 10% off coupon. And then pick two numbers. Is that four? Yep. So hit me with two numbers between 100 and 150. A few have been used, so not all of them are there, but hit me with those two five. numbers. What's up? She said five. She said five? She said, no, she oh, said five, five spins. Five. Okay, yeah, yeah. All right. Boom, and 5% off. So two different coupons. Coupons do not stack, but you can use them on separate orders. They do not expire. Um, the Thor stack over here. Has three issues. Number one, first print, second print, and the Halloween print. Uh, and also several other God of Thunder issues. It does not include the $100 plus dollar, uh, number two that everybody was asking about. The price would be a lot higher on this, to be honest with you, than that. Um, there's 16 issues in here. All these books are going for 10 to 15 a pop, selling for 10 to 15 a pop. And on top of that, there's also a couple in there that are about 20 to 30 as well. Very, very nice. Uh, six and 66, 666. Uh, so 66 is going to be Spider-Man number four. Awesome cover with Lizard. And number six is going to be Daredevil number 280. Very cool. Those are hers. I think that one must have been. Oh, no, that is mine, actually. Uh, that was bought from Easton. That's what they use on theirs. The, uh, they code their stuff for prices using those little things on the front. Yep. Um, oh, they, okay. It must have changed. I haven't been in there in a little while. Um, got the Christmas issues down here. Got the Incredible Hulk, the Venom, Spider-Man, Batman, Perillo variant, Batman last number one, Punisher number one, Nick Fury number seven, Gazar number one, high grade, Iron Man number three, four, and five. Very, very nice. First battle of Thor versus Hulk. Uh, got the Conan, Power Man, Transformers, Thanos, and Avengers stack still available. Masters of the Universe, Spider-Man, Alien and Predator, Daredevil stackers. Got a few Thor slabs available over here. Uh, some Journey into Mystery, Sign 98, Walter Simonson. Some Golden Age pre-hero horror stuff. Beautiful. 
And I got a ton of keys left in here, guys, and a ton of golden and silver age stuff in here still. Some astonishing tales, some Moon Knight, some Masters of Kung Fu, Defenders, Invaders, Captain Marvel, 2-in-1s, Team-Ups. Um, like I said, if you want to assemble a stacker of any of these characters or books, let me know. I have high-grade runs of everything in here, and I'll, I'll put together a stacker of anything that you guys see that you're interested in. Um, if there's a specific character, let me know if you want to build a, a character stacker. I'll put you together a nice stack of keys and, and other high-end issues from that character. Sitting on a bunch of stuff up here that's real nice too, man. We're running out of time, guys. Like I said, uh, we got about 25 minutes left in the show. We're going to end this one at 1 o'clock tonight as our usual time. So 25 minutes left. Get those claims in, people. Also, make sure to share this out. We definitely appreciate all the love. You go ahead and get this stacker moved out here. So it's not just sitting in the back. Um, I have two Star Wars, Alex. Two Star Wars issues, buddy. That's it. Uh, Ten bucks a pop on them. Twenty for the pair if you want them. That's the Dark Empire 2 number one. And the figure variant of the Nine Num. Both of those together. Twenty bucks if you want them, bro. Let me know. Twenty bucks on the pair. Um, Daredevil stack price. Uh, let me get together the Daredevils real quick. Because there's the only really nice ones in here for the most part. Um, so we got a nice number 17, that beautiful Spidey cover. Uh, you're looking at 50, 320. You're looking at about 410 um, for everything here because you got first Ramita, you've got the first 181 ad, you got the Stiltman, first Blackheart, the 26, nice 26, 25. 24, beautiful copy, 24, early Kazar, the 19, and the 17. Um, that's the price of all of them, but if you wanted them all together, obviously I can do a little bit better than that um, if you want to get the bundle. So let me know if you want to get them all together. The price on these would be... I could do, I could do three, man, this is, man, this is really cutting it down. 380. I would do 380 for the whole stack, man. Um, I can show them all fanned out to a little better if you'd like to see them so you see exactly what you're getting. I know I keep showing them one at a time. Sometimes it's a little easier to see everything kind of fanned out to see exactly what you're getting. And no problem on that, Katie. Give me just one second to kind of get these fanned out for them real quick to show them some of these books. Okay, so the Ramita, the 181 ad, Stiltman, Blackheart, Kazar, 25, the Spidey cover, the 19, and the early Kazar, 24. Beautiful copy on that one too, man. A few of these are really nice. Um, yeah, this one has this one does have some issues here. Um, there's It's kind of hard. I got to angle it. Um, there's some writing around the, there you go, you can see it better now. There's some writing around the uh, character. It's pencil writing, it seems to be. Somebody went around the edges of the Spidey body and some of the Daredevil. Um, but this one right here, because it is a lower grade, we have it priced at 85. Uh, this is the first John Romita. And this cover also is just a classic cover, but first John Romita art right there. Uh, first Marvel John Romita art. Uh, it might be first John Romita period, to be honest with you. But definitely first Marvel. Uh, the 24, the 19, the 17. Like I said, this whole stack here, all of these with the keys um, was like 420 or 430, 14. I think. Um, 410. 410, yeah, 410. Um, 410 for the whole stack. And like I said, I'll go down to, uh, what did I say on that? Three, what did I say 380? I think yeah, I think I said 380 on that. 
380 on the stack if somebody wants to get all those together. Uh, five. five spins, yeah. Five spins for 18. So Katie has five spins. Villain book. The first spin. Second spin. Villain book. Katie, what are you doing here? I was about to say, it was about to be a third one. Uh, one yellow and one white. Uh, DC comic. And is that four or five? That was four. And then pick two. Pick two numbers between one and 150. No problem, Pepe. Not a problem at all, buddy. Um, I tell you what, man. If you want to get just a couple of these, I can make a smaller stack. Um, because you have a lot of key issues in here. If I take out the keys, I can make a much better price for you, bro. Um, let me take out these three and the black heart because the black heart's even 30 just because it's a key. Um, so let me make another stack for you that's a little bit smaller as some Daredevil that's a little bit more priceable here. So you're looking at 50, 85, 125, 155, 200. So this stack would be 200 flat. Um, but if you want to get these all five issues, uh, if you want to get all five of these instead of 200, I could do 180 on them. So let me know if you want to get that whole stack, man. I'll do a buck 80 for the whole stack of those. That's a little bit more, uh, <coughs> easy on the price tag. So let me know if that works for you, man. Uh, I don't have a 271. Got rid of it, Edwin. Uh, 66 was already chosen. 60, yeah, 66 was already picked, Katie. Uh, but 33 is good. 33 is Arax, Son of Thunder, number 15. A Fire in the Fiend. Very cool. Very cool. Samuel said, how much for just the keys? Um, this, is a, this is a minor key that she just pulled, as a matter of fact. Is it? This is a sleeper. Look here. Oh! First Master of the Universe in... Mar in the DC. This nice. Was, this was the same story that was printed in DC Comics Presents. They reprinted it in all their books in November. That is badass. November. That is awesome. And it's a nice copy. Right. Very cool pool there, Katie. Right. Very cool. Uh, one second, Sam. I got you on that. Let me just get Katie's other pool for number 78, which gives her the Batgirl number 22. So a little DC love there as well. Um, so the key prices would be... 30 on the black heart high grade. You got 50 on the Spidey there, so that's 80. 85 on this one, so that's 165. And then we did 50 on that one, so it would be 215 on just the keys. Um, would be the full price on just the four keys. But if you want to get the four keys, um, I would do, uh, especially since you bought so much other stuff, man, I'll knock 25 off. Um, and do it for 190. So 190 for those four, if you want them, man. That's a deal right there. White and yellow for Katie. Um, oh yeah, white and yellow pools for Katie. So white pool is gonna get you a flash. That's that negative flash first cover mini key, and a Batman detective number 963. Yeah, right. Two villain books. Um, two villain books. That's right. The double dose of villainy. Um, so we're going to go back to some DC again. Try to give some DC some love tonight. Just a little bit. Um, here we go. Here's a cool one. How about, uh, this might even be one of the first appearances of, uh, Batman Who Laughs. I know it's an early one. Um, that's a cool one for the villain book. And then... Oh, here's a nice one. Here's a mini key. Because I'm just I'm just giving nice stuff out tonight. First appearance of Anarchy. That's a nice little key. Um, so yeah, 215 on those, or uh 190 on the keys, Sam, for these four. And then on these five over here, it was um what I think I said 180 or 200 ish. 180, yeah. I think it was 200 or two something, and then I went down to 180. So 180 on this stack here is a deal for all of them together, and then 190 on that stack there. That's a crazy deal on both of those, honestly. Um, still got all this stuff too, man. All the Thor goodness, all the Slabberinis. 
If anybody wants to get a deal on these together, let me know. I'm willing to hook up some of these books together, man. We're really running low on time. Uh, we got 15 minutes left in the show, guys. Last 15 minutes. All right, so I wish I had a little alarm. Or I have a little alarm now. I should have hooked it up. Um, I need like a little bell ringing to get the attention. But last 15 minutes of the show, guys, that means blowout. Hit me with them prices, man. You see something you want? Let's get it to you. Let's get it to you. You see something you want? Throw a number at me. We're going to make it happen for you. Obviously, I can't throw out two ridiculous numbers or accept two ridiculous offers, but uh, definitely always willing to work deals with you guys. Uh, X-Men 130s? Uh, I don't know. I think I might have got rid of all the X-Men's. I have a 146, 47, 48, 49, 50. Um, 199, 171, 164, 157. Got the special number one, 138 to 11. Um, that's it for the X-Men though. Talk to you about Spectacular Spider-Man number 90. Oh yeah, that's a beautiful one. Um, so the Spider 90. Got 60 bucks on that. Beautiful copy. Newsstand. High grade. Awesome book. Very early black cat. Early black suit. Very cool cover. Iconic. Great book, man. Great, great book. Absolutely love that one, man. Newsstand. Number 90. High grade. 60 bucks on that one. Forgot that was even in there. There's so much good stuff in here, man. So many keys. Symbiote Spidey 1. First appearance of Spot. McFarlane 1. Unlimited Un uh, 2. Spider Woman 1. First Corona. Kirkham cover. Carnage variant. Man, so much stuff. Uh, Fantastic 4 is under 100. Um, so I don't have much. I got a 69, a 68. Uh, my phone's down to 15%. A 97, an 86, a 93, a 96, annual 3, annual 2. That's about it for the older Fantastic Fours. If you're interested in some of those, Leonidas, let me know. I can always work out a bundle for you, man, if you want a few of them. Still got some cool slabs. Like I said, guys, time is ticking. If you see something you want, please speak up. You can always message me after the show. I'm always around throughout the week. Also, keep in mind that you can um, you can always hit me up uh, via direct messenger. You know what I mean? After the show. So if there's something that you miss or you don't get a chance to see, you can hit me. Feel free to hit me. Just not hard. We're usually up for a couple hours. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah, I'm usually up for a while afterwards, so... Um, let me know, guys. Got some Conan, Thor's, Thanos. I'm, like, like I said, if you see something you want, man, throw out an offer on these stacks, guys. I'm here to move these right now. I'm trying to get rid of these. These last 15 minutes, I sell stuff at slash prices. So if you see an offer, you something you want, throw me an offer, man. I'm telling you, I'll hook up deals right now. I'll knock off 20, 30, 40% off of stuff right now. Maybe even 50, depending on what it is. If you see something that you want, let me know. Let me know. I'm here to take them deals right now, man. You want something with a real good price, now's the time to ask for it. Last 15 minutes, I always give crazy deals. Every time. Yeah, definitely, Sam. Hit me up, brother. We'll get that invoice out to you uh, likely tomorrow. Usually I don't get invoices out the night of the show because we don't end till so late. But uh, invoices will go out tomorrow. I guess since we're after 12, technically it is today. <laughs> you'll get them today. So you'll get your invoices today anyway. Um, but technically tomorrow. Um, but yeah. Got some beautiful slabs up here still, man. If somebody wants to get a bulk deal on these, I'll do a thousand bucks on this whole bundle right here. For eight slabs. Including keys. High grade Silver Age. Thousand on those, man. You could resell those and make make a steal. To be honest with you, um, got this number ninety right here, spectacular Spidey. Got the Blade and Wolvey Virgin variant, Transformers border cover, uh, one forty four, nice Hellcat, first Juby, some uh, Dead of Winter, some Christmas issues, Deadpool, 
Venture into Fear. We got some Alpha Flight. Uh, we are in Maryland, Sam. If you ever want to come visit, man, let me know. We do take walk-ins. Uh, and I'm going to be honest with you, bro. This is this is nothing. This out here, I know it's crazy to even say that, right? But this is nothing because this, this is my personal collection. Okay, this is the personal collection. Now, I have some crazy stuff in here. Um, and it's all up for grabs right now, man. I'm selling off pretty much all my stuff until I get this building built. I'm going to keep selling books every week on this show until I can finance my building. I make a couple thousand usually every week, it seems. Um, and I also have a lot of, you know, people that are investing and, um, you know, looking into credit lines of credit, credit cards, things of that nature. So we're probably going to start up some fundraising here and some crowdfunding, but, uh, we're trying to get a building, man. I want to get a building up for Craven's comic books and collectibles. It's been my dream for a while to do that. Um, love selling books, love being on here and talking books with you guys. So, you know what I mean? This is, this is what I'm trying to do. Sold Katie on the adventures of fear for both of them for 20, just like that. See, don't even have to negotiate. Throw me out decent offers, guys, and I'll throw you out good stuff. I'm telling you. Where are those adventures of the fear at? Uh, there they are. Boom, right there. 20 bucks for the pair. Awesome deal on those, man. Um, fan those fantastic board fours bundle deal. Um, do you want just the ones under 100 or do you want all of them? Uh, no canon number six. Um, I want your store exclusive variants when you open your brick and mortar. Chris, we're planning on doing that, man. That's awesome you say that, buddy, because we do plan on doing that. <clears throat> and I might even end up doing some of the art for it because I like to draw myself. I've been tempted. Um, okay, so the Fantastic Four, waiting to hear back if he wants all of them or just the pre 100s. Probably just the pre 100s, I bet. Something tells me it'll just be the pre 100s. I don't have many of those, but I do have a couple. Um, also, let me know if you want the uh, the annual in there, the early annual, the two and the one, or the two and the, excuse me, the... What is it with the Canaan? That's... Giant size and the number three. I yeah. those. I was in the store the other day. I don't know, man. They're they're going crazy. Them, yeah, they do get asked about almost every time. Next time, I need to have the turtles out, too, because a lot of people have been asked about turtles tonight. Um, I forgot to write in the two issues for Fear Down. Which ones? What is it, 16 and 18? Isn't that what it was? The Fear, Adventures into Fear, 16 and 18? Yeah, 16 and yep, 18. 16 and 18, Katie. 16 and 18. Um, so here's the Fantastic Fours. I'll go ahead and do a little fan. Like I said, we are running out of time here, guys. Um, you have the 68, 69, 96, 93, 86, and 97. All number 100 um, pre-100s of Fantastic Four. So you're looking at a total of 20, 40, 55, 65, 75, 80, 120, 150. So you're looking at 150. If I charge the full on those, um, I will do it because I'm hooking up the dope deals. I'll knock 20 bucks off on that and do it for 130, dude. 130 takes that whole stack. 130 on all of them. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, six of them for 130. Awesome deal on those. Um, what else? Thanks. No problem, Katie. No problem at all. Let me put these aside. So, Ghost Riders. Nice high grade Ghost Riders. Venom stuff, Spidey's Carnage, uh, are they low or mid-grade? It's a mix, man. Um, it's a mix, to be honest with you. Uh, I don't think really any of them are necessarily low. I mean, there's some lower mid-grades. I mean, this one does have a little bit of water damage up here, to be honest with you. You can see that, though. I mean, that's pretty obvious. Um, 93... 96 isn't bad at all. 96 is pretty decent. 69 is pretty nice too, actually. It seems like the earlier ones actually are better. 69 is actually really nice. It's meant for its age. And the 68. 
I mean, I'll be honest with you, man. If these were higher grade, they'd be going for a lot more, a lot more than 130 for this deck. Um, but yeah, 130 takes all six of those, bro. So let me know on those. Um, I'll let this sit for a second. We are running out of time, guys. We're down to five minutes. Last five minutes. Like I said, throw out them for offers, man. Throw out an offer. Don't hesitate to throw out a price. If you see something you're interested in, hit me with an offer on something, man. I am here to make the deal. Here to make the deal, people. Got a lot of great stuff left in here. Stackers still. Still got a lot of stuff up here on the rack. Slabs. Early silver, bronze, keys, number one, sign books. I mean, man, you name it. Usually we got it. And if we don't got it, we'll get it. We'll, we'll find it. You know what I mean? We will grab it. Liberty Comics, number 198. Walter Simonson. Beautiful Daredevils. Blade vs. Wolvie, number one. Virgin variant. Transformers. Got that spectacular Spider-Man 90. Let's see. Astonishing Tales. If somebody wants a run of those, I got a nice stack of those if you'd like to get a run. Uh, Masters of Kung Fu I have a stack of. Novas. Um... What else do I have in here? I could stack her out. Uh, Iron Fist. Some really nice high-grade Iron Fist, man. Very, very nice early, early issues. High-grade. Um, Luke Cage high-grades. I've got uh, some 2 and one some team-ups. All types of good stuff. Marcel, you just getting here, brother? We are about five minutes tops from ending this one. I don't even know if we got it. We got three minutes left, buddy. Show him everything. Quick. Yeah, three minutes left. Uh, so a real quick recap before we head out here, guys. We have the Daredevils. Some beautiful Daredevils up here. If you'd like those, let us know. We have a bundle that's keys and a bundle that's non-keys. A couple Star Wars, some Nick Furies, early Defenders, second Moon Knight. A lot of Nick Fury, though. Beautiful stuff. Um, got this Virgin variant, some Transformers, Hellcat and Avengers, first Juby. Some Christmas theme books, Spectacular 90, Stacker of some Fantastic Four Silver. Uh, we got some slabs over here of some Thor and Journey into Mystery. Some Golden Age goodness with the Journey into Mystery. Uh, number 75, predating Thor. Uh, number 26 from Tales to Astonish. And the Liberty Comics, number one, one uh, signed by uh, Walter Simonson. The Black Panther, I have not had a chance to price out yet, Marcel. Um, I know you and a lot of other heads have been really amped about that, but the Black Panther will be coming next week, brother. 100% next week we will have the Black Panther um, on the show for sure. I had the whole run high grade, um, including the number one. I just haven't had a chance to price everything out yet. Uh, but, yeah, some great stuff up here still, man. Like I said, guys, throw out them offers. I'm telling you, I'll slash prices crazy right now, man. If you want one of these stacks, throw out a reasonable offer, and I will I will hook it up, I'm telling you. Throw out an offer. Throw out an offer on one of these stacks. Conan, Power Man, Iron Fist, Thor, Thanos, Transformers, Captain America, Avengers. The Predator, Daredevil, Masters of the Universe, Spider-Man. All types of good stuff, man. Like I said, if any of those characters interest you let me know we'll go ahead and throw them up i'm gonna put all new stacks out next show just to mix it up um usually we, we have stuff cycling out but i was really focusing on the keys tonight but we have tons of stacks guys i have so many i have long boxes full of really good stackers that are assembled bronze stuff so uh like i said we'll always be bringing that to the forefront we'll be back next week uh 9 p.m eastern standard time we might do a pop-up show in between make sure that you are following our page if you haven't sent us your paypal info yet please do so send it directly to the page if not we will contact you to get the info uh like i said every 9 p.m eastern standard time we do our show 
Tons of great books going up. Lots of Silver Age, bronze, keys, all that. If you ever want deals, let us know. If you're ever looking for specific books, let us know. We're always getting new things. If there's something that you see here on the show that you didn't have a chance to throw an offer on or you're curious about and you're checking this out after the stream goes off live, feel free to shoot us a message. We would love to talk with you and get you exactly what you're looking for, whether it's keys, runs, slabs, signed books, whatever it is. We're always on the hunt for new stuff. So like I said, follow the page. Make sure to check us out next Sunday, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I will check you guys out later. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the show, and thanks for supporting a small, independent-run family business. I appreciate you guys, and I'll see you guys next week. Keep it comics. Later. And Happy New Year's.